Y'all got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. Honey sauce is currently uh, cooking for the children, y'all. Just know, Monday through Friday, we really parents, like in real life, all throughout the week. But during this time, we got to cook for them kids, make sure they have a meal when they come from, from the schoolhouse. All right. Next thing, make sure y'all follow me on Twitch, twitch.tv slash royalties, where our CEO link is in the pinned comment. We just reacted to baddies. Uh, did I post that last night? I hope I did. We reacted to baddies. Uh, definitely posting it in the Patreon, if it ain't already posted, because I believe it is, uh, in the Patreon. Uh, and make sure y'all tap in. We react to the whole episode. Now, before we get into Blueface and his sassy tail self, I just want to say to the ladies in the comments, especially to the ladies that had babies, shout out to y'all, bro. Like, I don't think women get enough respect and I don't understand why. Um, but for some reason, the men who, okay, Austin, I'll put it in there. The men who, well, obviously if you're a man, you're here, you came out of a woman. I will never understand the disrespect that women get when we the ones who bring y'all bald head asses to earth. Like, I don't, I'll never understand that. Like, back in the old days, women got to beg to vote, beg to have a voice, and beg for this and beg for that. I don't understand that. When women are the most powerful uh, human beings on this earth, somehow this became a man's world, but he came, he came from a woman. I would never understand that. <laughs> but anyway, so Blueface, I believe, is in like, bro living in the 1900s slash 1800s because he really feel like nowadays women like have to have a man in order to survive. Now, obviously, you have to have a man to have children. So don't come to me with the, you got to have a man for certain things. Duh. Duh. Right? But what I mean is, see, after you had that baby, a lot of them leave anyway. You know what I'm saying? So you don't necessarily need them. So anyway, we're going to get into some of these tweets. And if he deleted it, shout out to Jashara. I got it. And I'm going to read it to y'all. Okay? So we're going to start from 16 hours ago. Jaden got a hit for real. I'm so proud of her. I just want y'all to know that is a hit. I like the song. I ain't no hater. Never been in my blood. I like the song. That don't mean y'all got to like the song, but I like the song. Okay. He said, when I wake up in the morning, I check Jaden analytics streams. No, sir. You check your own. Okay. You check your own. <laughs> um, and I figure out how to make it better than yesterday. I'm the security EP A and R manager pr label we don't need nobody help long as she keep long as she keep listening and learning it we'll continue to work this is my third time doing this okay um i will say i think he does a good job i i'm sorry y'all i think he does a good job hold on i think he does a good job and i do feel like blueface is a genius i won't take that from him Okay, uh, he also said, I love to say I told you so. And I don't know what he talking about with that. But uh, that was at 449 in the morning. He's a shady lady at night. So he talks a lot of his stuff at night. Okay, next. I'm not a genius or anything. I'm just a regular guy. That's Cap. He is a very smart dude. Uh, here is the other topic that we're going to talk about. When you make dinner, you serving your kids first or daddy first? Obviously, kids get served before stepdaddy. I'm talking about in a real household. What do you think? Now, I think, well, first of all, I get served first and or it depends. <laughs> because if I'm not in the kitchen and the kids is in the kitchen because they be in there waiting on their damn plate. um, The kids get served first, obvious reasons. But nobody's about to be like, hold on. Uh-uh. Kids, wait. I know your plate right here, but I'm going to take daddy to plate first. What? <laughs> he, like, we are not in the times of the, the, the ancient anymore. You know what I'm saying? Like, we're not in the old days. And I feel like he is in the old days. Not only that, y'all, 
Bitch, I got a lot to say today. His mother, okay, she is the head of her household right now, currently, got to be. Because her husband don't say nothing. He don't seem like he's doing anything but her show, which is her show. Now, I don't know if he's funding it. I could be wrong. But the man don't say nothing. He don't say, shut your ass up. He don't say, stop talking crazy about your kids. He don't say, chill out. But I got that nothing. Okay? So, she is no longer a traditional woman. Now, Blueface is absolutely a traditional guy, and nothing is wrong with him being a traditional guy. Ivan, Yvonne, however I say it. Nothing's wrong with that, right? It's just don't project it on everybody else. He be making, he be making it seem like to the world that... I'm going to tell you why I'm saying this. I'm going to tell you why I'm saying this. His next tweet, okay... Well, the, the serving the kids, make plate first on schoolyard, I'm a king. This is the tweet. It's only black women saying the kids get served first. If my dad got his plate first, I'd be cool with it. But if if it's just my mom's boyfriend over or some I'ma be or something, I'ma be pressured up for sure. Nigga, what is you pressured up for? You're not giving your mama the meat. <laughs> So why wouldn't she be able to give her boyfriend a plate first? I thought it was the man of the household. I'm, I'm in confusion, okay? So anyway, that is why I wanted to lead to this tweet right here. I just think he can be condescending at times, and I think that's just his nature. You know what I'm saying? He's just a condescending-ass dude. Like, I don't feel like the man of the household should get fed first. I think it's the dad. Okay, so if the dad is the one who's there playing that uh, masculine role, then why wouldn't he get fed first? So that's condescending, but that's his opinion. That is his opinion. He has the right, you know what I'm saying, for his opinion. Um, and I think the shot at black women was to get him some attention today. I think he wanted to piss black women off today to get some attention, and hopefully black women don't give him that. Uh He's saying that because he's saying that Jaden gives the um, the plate first. Jaden isn't black or I'm fully black, whatever, girl. So here we are with that. All right, anyway, so somebody said, I need to grow up. I'm 26 with two kids. I'm grown as hell. I ain't changing nothing but my drawers. And um, I just think he's just old-minded as hell, but grown man. Jaden must be the last real woman left of this generation. Too many women trying to dictate things without the dick to take. Y'all, when niggas talk like this, it, for me, I be like, bro, ain't no way. <laughs> Y'all, no I pay all the bills in this motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? I never said that I was a man, and I don't want to be one. God knows. If I was born with a penis and it was small, I would lose my mind. Okay? Like, for real. Like, hold on, ma. Pops, yo. Y'all gave me this shit? I want y'all to know I love my vagina. And this is to the people that's new. Just because I'm a stud up here, y'all don't know what's going on, baby. I love me. I love this coochie, too. Now, I can't stand these titties because they just too damn big. But other than that, I love my vagina, okay? And I love being a woman. But in my household, you know, I take care of everything. Cause I'm a G. You know what I'm saying? It ain't got nothing to do with me being a man or a woman. I'm just a G. You know what I'm saying? But I don't have to take no dick to, to handle my household. All right. It's a lot of single parent ladies that take care of their household as well. I think Blueface just want a woman he could walk all over. Am I wrong? Am I wrong? I think he want a woman that he could just, you know what I'm saying? Skip on the back type shit, you know? And it's not too many women out here like that these days. I think he's he's given Jaden no choice. Or, hell, Jaden also hasn't given herself no choice because she's not picking up, you know what I'm saying? Not standing up for herself, you know? So I just think that he wants to, like, if he don't control nothing, he don't feel like he's a man, you know what I'm saying? Um... And that's his prerogative. And I think a lot of, especially black men, 
Like I've heard a black man say, if I if I can't take care of the bills, or if I can't um, you know, just do that traditional shit, then what the fuck you want me for? Well, I mean, first of all, you're a man. Do some shit around the house. That's what men supposed to do. You know what I'm saying? Uh, what about the dick? She can't get it from nowhere else if she's supposed to be faithful to you. Drop some dick. You know what I'm saying? Uh, <laughs> get some seeds about that dick. You know, yo, you need the dick to get pregnant. I'm fully aware of that. You know what I'm saying? That's another reason why you around. How about love? You get what I'm saying? You love. You know, she need love. Okay, you a man. You got your chest out. I candy. I don't know. I, other stuff. Other stuff. You don't have to necessarily uh, be in control of everything just to be a man. Or if I can't pay your bills and, and, and you know, shit like that, then, then what am I here for? That's, uh, I blame society and that, that fucking not 1800th century bullshit that they created a long time ago. Because it's just, it's not the same anymore. Like, Blueface is able to go along with the times when it comes to him making money. But he can't change that time shit with the household, bro. And his mother is not a good example because it's like, where did you get that from? Because <laughs> she's not a good example. Like, Callie out here, it seems, I could be wrong, but doing her single mom thing, I, I don't know if the dads are around, but it don't seem like they are uh, from what hit, her mama be talking about. So it's like, what is it? What's really... What's really going on? Anyway, uh, the last thing he said was, um, well, in 2023, you got to have money just to date a broke bitch, uh, whatever that means. And then he said, y'all really think I wrote this, wrote that is blasphemy. Nigga, you wrote that song. I don't feel like, now, I ain't saying Jaden ain't talented, but you don't never give a, no credit for nothing else. So this is, this right here is the control biting him in the ass. Hips, lips, ass in a car. Do you say you wrote that shit? You wrote that shit. <laughs> Hips, lips, ass in a car. I wonder how he was looking when he said that shit. Because <laughs> this is the time that you take control of everything else with Jaden. Why the hell wouldn't we think that he wrote it? Like, why wouldn't we think that? I love being, and I sit like a Barbie, hips, lips, ass in a cardi. He wrote that shit, bro. He wrote that shit. Hello, motherfucker. Motherfucker. He wrote that shit. Like, I, I just don't understand. Now he trying to act like, hold on, hold on. I'm a man, though. You know what I'm saying? I'm a, I'm a man. <laughs> Nigga, you wrote that shit. He trying to be tough all the time. It's okay. It's a lot of men who write hits for women, and that shit be sassy as hell. But they hits, though. <laughs> they hits. Do y'all know Dr. Dre? First of all, I don't know if y'all know Misha Lay, but Dr. Dre used to write a lot of her songs. But he's wrote a lot of feminine music, but not like, well, I don't know if he's, you know, written any of this, this type shit these days. But, yeah, Lil Yachty wrote... Uh, the song for the city girls. Exactly. Real ass bitch give a fuck about a nigga. That was Lil Yachty if y'all don't know. Okay? So, you got to put yourself in a, in, in a feminine woman's shoes to be able to write that body of art. Act Up was one of the songs for 2020. What, what, what we in? 2023? Probably 2020 summer. Real ass bitch give a fuck about a nigga. Okay? Cardi B writer is a man. Facts. So it's just, he is just condescending as hell. And that's just his nature. You know what I'm saying? That's just his nature. But I will say, I think Blueface is absolutely a genius, though. He just won't own it. You know, he rather, he rather have the I'm the man role. I run this shit rather than, you know, I put some shit together. I can handle some shit. I can get some shit done. I think his, his bag would maximize even more if he actually stand in his genius. Well, what do I know? Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. Uh, do you think Blueface is a shady lady? Um, do you think that he wrote that damn song <laughs> for Jaden? Me? Hell yeah. Um, 
Do you think he was referring to Krishan with uh, what I think he was talking about with Krishan is, um, um, fuck was it? He the manager of the PR and all that shit. He don't need no help. Um, I feel like he was referring to her with that and a couple of these other things he was saying. Do you think he was referring to Krishan at all today? And do you think he made the black women statement to piss off black women for today so he could get some attention? I would just want to know what y'all think about that down in the comment section below. You dig what I'm saying? Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hell yeah.